It's actually really pretty. <laughs> okay, we're not failing yet. Hey everyone, welcome back. So there has been this challenge going around of different YouTubers having their dogs pick out their makeup for them. Uh, <laughs> and it's been crazy and awesome. And I was wondering if any YouTubers had done their cats picking out their makeup, because I don't have dogs, I have two cats. And I think I found only like three other YouTubers that had their cats pick out their makeup, or their cat. Um, so I think... There's probably more, but uh, for now I'm going to be the fourth, so I'm excited. Um, we're going to have Boo and Belle pick out my makeup. I'm going to grab them and show you them if you haven't seen them yet, uh, if you're new. <laughs> so one second. Can I tell you, it took me 20 minutes to wrangle both of them. <laughs> so these two are going to be picking out my makeup today. I am nervous. First off, this is Belle, if you do not know her. <laughs> she just turned two. She is a Torby which is part tortoiseshell, part tabby. And she's the baby. And this is Boo. He is the oldest, but he is also two. He's four months older than Belle. He's also the shyest cat. <laughs> he has a long hair. Whoops, sorry. He has a long hair. We think he's part Maine Coon. Um, and part just domestic mix. But yeah, now that I've wrangled them kind of in this area, we're gonna see how they pick this makeup. Here we go. Belle seems more interested in picking than Boo. But okay, we've got four different options. Oh no, don't do that one, don't do that one. <laughs> oh no, Boo. He's gonna save it for later. <laughs> I figure maybe if I throw them, it might be more appealing. You guys are not helping. <laughs> if I throw them that way. Oh, here we go. Okay, they both chose the lighter one. I only have one contour palette, which is this. So that's what we're gonna have to go for. Okay, so he chose this one. <laughs> he runs away. This is harder than I thought. <laughs> I've given them a toy to they play with. They'd rather do that. <laughs> Hang on. Pick one of these and then I'll play with you. <laughs> nope. She wants me to do the feather for my blush. <laughs> oh, she picked this one. Okay. I'll play for a bit. We'll be back. Which one's she going for? Which one's she going for? <gasps> okay, she picked the chocolate palette. Oh, she just hit the peach one though. Oh, okay. Are you indecisive now? Now she's really liking the shiny one. So she picked these three. She's really liking the shiny, but maybe if I switch it up. Which one do you want? She's wanting the shiny now. She originally chose this one. Now she wants all the bright colors. <laughs> well, she's physically touching that one, but she kicked that one first. Someone pick one, please. <laughs> Do you want the pink one? Good boy, boo. Good boy, you made a decision. <laughs> she just fell over. She's like, I'm done, mom. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna need both hands for this. <laughs> yeah. <gasps> you picked one. You actually picked three. So, Boo, do you want to come pick one out? Mm. 
Okay, well now he's in between those two. But he's pointing at that one. So is this the one you really want? Yeah? Or do you want this one? You want that one now? <laughs> Which one? This was your first choice. This was your first one. But this was your second one. Well, he sniffed this one again, so I'm going with that one. Which one, boo? Alright, you went in between these two, which are two very different colors. <laughs> There's brown and black. So we're gonna give Belle the final pick. Which one? You want that one. Oh, good job. Okay. This is kind of fitting. The cats chose my makeup, so I'm gonna wear cat ears to do my makeup. Alright, so Boo chose the NYX Total Control Foundation. Now this is a great foundation, but it is a shade lighter than my skin tone. This should be fun. I'll look very, very pale. <laughs> More so than usual. Actually, yeah, it's pretty pale. <laughs> Done. So next up, Boo chose the L'Oreal Magic Lumi Highlighter. So this is my concealer. I think it works well for this foundation though, because it's still pretty pale. And this is actually good that she didn't choose the other one, because the other one would have been way too dark. This is actually like the same color. <laughs> oh well. I'm going to quickly just set this for a minute, because it's so hot in here, I don't want this to just start sliding off my face. Now, on to contour. Uh, this is the only contour kit I have, so the kitties didn't technically get to choose this one. And usually with contour, you can kind of get this shade to slowly blend in with the rest of your skin. That looks presentable. <laughs> Belle chose uh, Too Faced Sweetheart's Perfect Flush Blush in the color Peach Beach. So it looks like that. There we go. Now I look alive. <laughs> now I'm going to do highlight Boo chose NYX Dose of Dew, which is my absolute favorite highlighter. And I like to apply it with my finger because it is a stick and so it's a little bit more wet. And it gives you a little bit more control this way. So far the kitties are kind of killing it with the makeup choices. Now we move on to eyes. I still have no idea what I'm doing with this because they picked the Shaney palette which is all these amazing rainbow colors but I only pull these out really for Halloween and kind of crazy makeup looks so what should I do? <laughs> it is chucking down rain. It's ridiculous. <laughs> this is starting to sound really creepy like an apocalypse. <laughs> so I'm gonna start off kind of with this weird pea green color all over my eyes because I want to see what this looks like. This is normally something I would never go for but it's kind of a good transition with the yellow that I want to use, maybe? Now, I'm gonna go in with this kind of corally, peachy shade and just the little outer corner. I wish this had a mirror, this would make it so much easier. I'm also just bringing it right up in the crease as well. Now I'm going to go in the inner corner with the yellow. Then I'm actually going to take that coral again and go underneath as a little transition shade. Okay. 
Then I'm going to do this kind of hot pink color on the little outer corner of my under eye. I do like the greenish color, however I'm also going to go over it with this green just a little bit to make it just a little bit brighter. That's better. Super hard parts over. Okay. I'm actually really happy with that. I also didn't take into account that the lipstick may not go with this. Let's do eyeliner first. I've actually forgotten how to use this one. Slow and steady Wednesdays. Now they chose the Pumped Up Colossal Volume Express by Maybelline New York for the eyelashes. And oh my god, that is gooey. I rarely ever use this one because it is so goopy. But... Oh well. And then the finishing touch, which may just make this look completely horrifying, is the Revlon Matte Balm in the color Fierce, which is a gorgeous color, but it's a very fall color, and I've realized I've put very summery looking colors on top. Yeah, the look was so close, and then I did the lip. <laughs> like, if we just did this, it would look great. Even if the lipstick was blue, it would go with the eyes, but they like oddly go together, oddly don't. It's a very weird in between. But yeah, there we go. We are done, and this is the finished look of what the cats have picked out for me. Ah! I have to say, my cats kind of aced this. I'm pretty proud. But yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys. Remember to give this video a like, and please subscribe if you're new or haven't done so yet. And if you'd like to get notified when I post new videos, you can click that bell somewhere down there, and that'll let you know. And I will see you guys next time. Bye! <sighs> My glasses are fogging up. Yeah, that was your choice. She doesn't care. <laughs>